Okay, welcome back to the second part of this section of the course. Now, we've spoke about what the benefits are for uh, businesses to be using Instagram. Um, I now want to talk about the benefits of just growing an Instagram in general and having a big page um, connected to an individual niche or industry. So in this course, we're going to talk a lot about viral content and, and how that can really quickly grow your brand and you know increase your follow count. Um, that's true. So we can use that on both business uh, Instagrams and we can use that on uh, just niche specific standard general sort of Instagram accounts. So the ones I'm talking about now. Um, we would use the viral content strategy more with, with the standalone brand in Instagram opposed to going all out viral content on the business one. Uh, purely and simply because you want to you wanna have a good mix of you know viral content branded content and then products and services and you know selling your own sort of uh, business. With the uh, branded pages, you have a lot more room for growth. You can really, really you know, pump out viral content on a daily basis. Where in a business one, it might be every couple of days. It's still fast, but um, obviously it's a lot more controlled. Branded pages are just all out viral content growing as fast as you can. You know, we've had some clients get to 100,000 in two months. Uh, the standard is around 50,000 in about three or four months, you know, it can be really, really quick. Now, you're probably asking, why, why would I build out a big Instagram? What's the benefits of having a big Instagram? Uh, and what sort of business can that lead into? So th there's, there's a few things, you know. So what we find is actual business owners will reach out to uh, individual pages that, you know, control a certain demographic of follower. So let's just say, for example, you are a an automobile, you, you post videos of luxury cars, uh, you have 100,000 followers, every single one of them followers has come through a piece of viral content associated with luxury cars, so you know they're interested in that niche. Now, a business owner may look at your account, they may own a car dealership, and they may say, okay, this is a great account, they get a lot of engagement, uh, all of their followers are you know, car lovers, they, they're into luxury cars, uh, they leave comments, they're really interested in them. Um, so that's you know a good demographic client for us to go and advertise our services to. So what will then happen is they'll reach out to you and they will offer you X amount of money um, and you can kind of negotiate for your rates and you then post an advert for that company. So you know, you're left with 100% profit in your pocket because you've got no cost of posting an image on Instagram on your, your own page, so it's free. That's the business model that most influencers use. And it's just getting paid for sharing other people's content, sharing business, uh, sharing businesses, sharing products, and that kind of thing. So yeah, from the back of that, you know, it could lead to brand deals, it could lead to you being sponsored by a brand, that kind of thing, you know. The possibilities are endless, you know. It's, um, it's a good thing to have, it's, it's, it's an option that's always gonna be there whether you're just doing it for fun and just want to go viral and you know get a big following or if you actually want to move it into the sort of business realm you know you could open up 10 different accounts doing the same strategies that I'm going to teach you and literally just sell influencer shout outs and you know we have some clients that are making 10,000 plus a month on their on their around 300,000 follower pages and all they do is share pictures and share products that other people are selling another thing to mention is of course these pages are worth a lot of money. Once you've built up a sizable following with a targeted demographic of follower, it's worth money. You know, businesses want to invest in that kind of thing, especially the way the world's going. Uh, more and more businesses are coming online. More and more people are, are appreciating that influencer marketing is a thing. Um, and you know, having an Instagram account that's sizable is a worthy asset to any business. So yeah, having that amount of followers and then will be in target to one sort of industry and demographic is extremely, extremely valuable. So you could always look at selling your account on. Other than that, you know, the, like I said, the possibilities are endless. It's kind of how you, you negotiate and you leverage that amount of following for yourself, whether you want to start up your own branding, whether you want to start up, uh, whether you want to start up your own business and you, you've already got that pool of followers there to support you. Uh, and almost kickstart any products or services that you want to sell, or perhaps it's just you want to do it for fun. You want to, you know, you're interested in that topic. You want to see if you can get some influencer shout outs uh, through your page, and um, and yeah, maybe start your your own influencer career. Who knows? You could be the next Kylie Jenner, charging a million dollars 
uh, for one Instagram post. You know, we can all dream and I hope you do do it. But um, just remember who taught you, okay? It's a nice one, guys. Catch you in the next part of the course.